This is my electric tandem bicycle. So far it has been very fun to ride and we've done a lot of kilometers this year. So for the battery and the motor, it has a 17 battery, 48 volt and a 1500 watt motor. It has also a decent acceleration, top speed is about 50 and 55 kilometers per hour so uh, maybe 30 miles an hour the tires have got a very high quality tires and uh, double thickness tubes because uh, i've got two flats already this year i'm very tired of getting flats so that should get rid of this problem one thing you gotta notice is it's get people attention very much people uh, talk to us all the time and are really happy to see our bicycles yes they really uh, like it it has uh, some negative though <laughs> the controller it works fine if you use only the throttle but the main problem is uh, when it comes to the pedal assist i'll explain when you pedal it will take about a second or two before it's kick in and when you stop pedaling is it even worse because it will uh, the motor will stop after maybe a second so you're stuck with the bike accelerating and uh, you don't even pedal anymore and that's a full blast 1500 watts pushing you and you don't want to so uh, i've done a little work around is that uh, i turned off completely the pedal assist and uh, i used a secondary left throttle i removed the spring from that throttle so it acts like maybe uh, a little bit of a cruise control it allows to uh, use the speed i want and the power i want but uh, without any delays another negative is that uh, the brakes on this particular bicycle are not so good for uh, high speed braking up to 30 kilometers per hour is very good but uh, not enough for uh, if you have uh, to do emergency brakes at uh, 40 kilometers per hour and also it will add maybe uh, 30 pounds of weight or uh, 12 kilos so uh, quite a lot of weight but when you are two pedaling on the bicycle this is not uh, this is not that much the weight are uh, very worth it in my opinion because we live in the countryside and when there is a lot of end wind one time we haven't the motor and it was so hard to pedal we were stuck at like 10 kilometers per hour for an hour forcing through the wind so with this motor we can still do uh, 20 30 kilometers an hour and uh, through the wind head wind and uh, not be uh, toasted by uh, over exercise and also we can do uh, long distances very easily now as for the battery range it will depend a lot of how you use the motor for example often we only use maybe 25 percent of assistance when we ride slow at maybe 20 kilometers per hour often we don't even use the power of the motor only for the headwinds the hill climbs and uh, we always use it for uh, starting from a red light or a stop and some days we can even use it up to 75 percent when when there are very strong winds and this can bring the range down to about 30 kilometers we have only a single battery.
but uh, this happened one time. There, there was a crazy headwind. We were pedaling a lot, and also the motor was giving a lot of power, almost 1,000 watt continuously. But in general, we are good for at least 60 to 100 kilometers of range on this single battery. If you liked that video, then give it a good thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe!